Hi, it's Paul from Wave5Trade.com and today is Thursday the 5th of April and this is my daily look at one of the signals from our Wave5Trade stock signal service. Uh, so very briefly in our members area, our members can choose between short and long trades and we provide signals every day on weekly, daily and 60 minute time frames for swing trades uh, for the fifth wave of the Elliott Wave sequence which is the highest probability move in a trend. So for long trades I've chosen today, members simply click on the image, download the spreadsheet. Let's have a look at the spreadsheet for today. Again, for the longs we provide signals for the weekly, the daily and the six minute time frame. So on the daily today, we had a good bullish day yesterday recovery. Uh, so there's quite a few um, potential swing trades for the fifth wave on the daily time frame. So I've gone to the top of the list on MU. So let's have a look at the chart. OK, so I'm using the Wave 5 Trade Elliott Wave Indicator Suite for the Ninja Trader platform, but it is available on Think of Swim, Trade Station, and Multi Chart. So, for our members here, I want to uh, first discuss why I've isolated the wave count back here uh, in um, in August last year. So, our new version three software shows a very strong bullish trend with false breakouts down here on the stochastic down at the bottom there. And that is the start of this current trend that we're in. Uh, we did go sideways for a while and then we had another push up and now it's pulled back against that trend. Um, so that's where to isolate August, uh, the lows of August last year. Um, the scanner membership gets filled. The filters are uh, for the 535 oscillator. We've pulled back between 90 and 140 percent. The stochastic has pulled back in the oversold zone against the false breakout. So it's, it's, it's proving a really strong probability it's going to go higher again. And the wave falls pulled back into our automated probability zones here. So let's have a closer look at those. So with the probability zones, we found support at the top end of the amber zone there. The amber is an 80% probability it's going to go on and make a new wave 5 high into our automated target zones here around about 6740. Um, so I setting setting up this trade uh, is reasonably simple. We have the 6-4 moving average high here as part of the Elliott Wave Indicator Suite. And those are our conservative entries. So for today's bar position if we can continue that bullish momentum from yesterday which is unusual in the market uh, these days um, in, the, in the last six weeks anyway but if that does happen we can break the six ball moving average high at 56.05 so above the whole 56 dollar mark so a good entry is 56.05 and then the stop loss we want to be below the wave for low um, and we want to be below the whole whole $49 mark. So I've gone for a $48.95 stop loss. So a $48.95 stop loss, 56.05 entry still gives us a decent 1 to 1.6 risk to reward into our automated target zones there, around about $68. So good looking trade, very simple setup, came from our stocks signals membership which is only $97 a year and we give signals every single day. I've used the Elliott Wave Indicator Suite for Ninja Trader for this particular example. Isolated the wave count, wave falls pulled back, found really great support, had a great day yesterday. We're looking for that bullish momentum to continue into today and look for that high probability fifth wave move into $68. So that's it for today. Have a great trading day and I'll speak to you all tomorrow.